We're back at the Open Source Bridge Conference. This is Strange Love Live. I'm Kimmy Chaos, and this is Daniel Johnson, a volunteer here at the conference. Hello. How you doing, Daniel? Uh, I'm I'm doing pretty well. I'm a little tired. Uh, yesterday was so so much greatness here, <laughs> and then I got up early to experience more of it. More more absolute grace. I, I actually I believe on Twitter I said awesomeness, uh, but same thing. Yesterday was so much of it. And then we're here back for more today. Where can we find you on Twitter and online? Uh, well, I'm on uh, Tech Notice. I forgot to take your badge away. Oh. That's okay. You've already got it. Is that a foul? On. Yeah, apparently it's shiny. Oh. Well, it doesn't show. Oh, it, it doesn't. Shot. Okay, good. You're fine. Just keep it. Just pretend I said nothing. Uh, okay. Uh, tech Notice. Tech oh, Notice. It's like Take well, Notice. Please. I know it, I'd always seen, I've seen your, your Twitter before, and I, I wondered, I always thought it was Tech Notice. Or no, te- I thought it was ten Otis. Yeah, I pronounced the K silently. That's what it was. Um, well, it's more like take notice. Yeah. Okay. And I'm not sure if that's I, I'm taking notice of things or or I want to do things that people would take notice of. But someone should take notice of something. Eventually. <laughs> so it's T E K N O T U S on Twitter. And where are you online? Uh, well, I I actually have the domain name technot.us. So not. Oh, just my 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 uh, my Twitter with a name dot with it. a dot. And you are a volunteer here at the conference. Yeah. Did you have you been? What has been your primary mission as a volunteer? Oh, just if something goes horribly wrong, to run out of the room screaming and saying, "Please help! Please help!" <laughs> uh, fortunately, that. Hasn't that hasn't happened. Right. No. Things have been going pretty smoothly. Yeah. Yeah. Um, you wanted to talk about education potluck, or not so much that you wanted to talk about it, but we bribed you with shiny books. You did. They're very <laughs> shiny, and, and I can't even decide which one I want. They're, they're, they're good. Well, you'll get to decide. You can stand there ogling them as long as you want to. But why don't you tell me about education potluck in the meantime? Well, so uh, education potluck is uh, my the name I came up with for the um, idea of a instead of having the bar camp once a year, mm-hmm. I wanted to have something that was more regular, mm-hmm. like really, really regular, like once a week. Wow. And but shorter topics, mm-hmm. and and you have a potluck first, so you have food. Mm-hmm. And you're all happy and, and socialized before you uh, start, you know, teaching each, each other little things. And so it's, uh, it's education potluck as in an actual potluck. Yeah. But also education potluck is in a metaphorical potluck of education. Because you're bringing... You, you, you bring a, a subject like you would bring a dish mm-hmm. to a potluck. And so everyone has little things that they know. And, and often those are, are not a subject that is um, you're going to find a book about or that you're going to find a college education on. Mm-hmm. Um, and, um, you know, like I talked to a college professor. He's like, I'd like to t- teach fancy shoelace knots. It's like, this will only take me 15 minutes, maybe only 10 minutes. I have to ask an important question. Is it the lacing of the shoes and in which way you lace it? Because I've seen all sorts of ways of lacing. Or is it the actual tying? Well, I don't know because he hasn't taught it yet. But have he you said that, that if I started this, that would be one of the first things that he'd want to teach. So have you started this yet or is it still in its, uh, it's conception it's, it's, phase? It's, it's incubating. Mm-hmm. I, I started thinking about it, you know, over last year or sometime. I was like, I, I want some kind of... of uh, uh, a, a new form of, of uh, learning, mm-hmm. uh, a, a way of, of getting mentors for all kinds of things, and I think I, I think it was a started out as selfishly because I just wanted people to teach me all kinds of things, and I was like, how can I get them to do that? Mm-hmm. Um, I, I started by teaching other people, but they weren't teaching me back. They're like, here, how could I could pay you? I could I could buy you dinner, and I was like. But I want you to teach me awesome things. I don't want to just teach you things. And mm-hmm. it's like, it, even if it, you make it... Yeah, very open source of you. It, even <laughs> if they, they gave me money and I profited from it, mm-hmm. 
that that wasn't what I wanted. I yeah. wanted I wanted people to You wanted to adopt unique and interesting skills and information. Yeah. Yeah. Stuff that I wouldn't find anywhere else. So when do you think it's gonna happen? Uh, I, I I've got some a variety of people who have gotten interested in it. Mm -hmm. And I just um, I brought it up at uh, bar camp and I had a bunch of people who were just got pretty excited about the idea because mm -hmm. um, well I mean already they're in the same kind of thing and they're like oh being able to do this weekly or you know like maybe I can't do it one week but then I'm only waiting one week you're not and waiting then I the can whole year yeah, yeah. And, and get to do it again um, so I, I think I may have been preaching to the choir at that point yeah um, but I, I I've just been like really busy the last month or so since then and I think I think I'll, I'll I, I just need to get the communication lines up for talking about getting a, a kickoff event which I, I think once it gets going it'll be really easy but um, I, I think I'm probably worrying a little too much about the initial um, buzz about it doing it right the first time um, but well, it's, gonna, it's an educational potluck. It's got to be a learning experience. It's not, you know what? Yeah, it's not going to be perfect the first time. You just got to keep going and going and going. And then eventually, you'll have too many people and you'll have to turn them away. Well, no, then, <laughs> then, then you, you, then you can have uh, multiple people doing, uh, instead of it just oh, being, you, you know, one, one, one thing. You know, you, yeah, I mean, like you could have a, um, a, a camping skills one where, you know, someone teaches how to make fire, someone else teaches uh you know camp cooking oh, someone so you teaches do it, uh, uh, th there's a specific topic each time that you bring something for well you, you could do that you could have a theme to it you don't have to have a theme to it you know i if you if uh i mean i i wouldn't be as interested in it if it was always technology yeah i i'd like to uh exchange knowledge between you know all kinds of things um I think it's a really cool idea. I think it's great. And when you figure out when the first one's going to be, let us know so that we can retweet it. Okay. That would be very cool. Can you tell me real quickly before we go, uh, what for the, because we're more than halfway through OS Bridge at this point. We're bumping up the end of day two. What are you looking forward to from here out? Well, I'm, I, I this is this is different from any conference I've been to before in that we don't just have the pre-planned sessions. Mm -hmm. We have this extra day which is is like a bar camp. Yes. But unlike a, a typical bar camp, we've had two days of inspiration to lead up to it. So it's it's gonna be the okay, what what was such a big, amazing topic that we want more of it? And so I think, I, I'm hopeful at least that tomorrow is just gonna blow my mind. It's gonna be, you know, what, whatever we, we, we got into and just wanted more and more and more of it and that that's what's gonna, gonna be tomorrow. I, I think that's a lot of what tomorrow's gonna be. I think that's a very, very cool part of this. I, when they announced that the third day was going to be on conference, I thought that that was a really smart way to do things. Because if you do it on the first day, there's no momentum from it. Yeah. Yeah. It was really good to talk to you, Daniel. Thank you so much for coming on. Go ogle the shiny books and pick one. Sign your guest board. I'm really glad you came by. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>